Uh, this is a question that comes from the engineer inside me. Are you following the AI revolution based on whatever's happening in the world? I'm sure you are. Uh, <laughs> I mean, that was just an intro to the question. Okay, that's podcasting techniques. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the role of AI. I would love for you to also give an input on the role of quantum computing because it's come up in geopolitical conversations. Mm -hmm. uh, how do you look at it from your perspective? The future of technology, I don't know if you should watch this uh, show called Black Mirror. No, I haven't. Okay, it's about the technologies that are upcoming. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. Yuval Noah Harari says that the stuff they've shown in Black Mirror is so realistic. It's either already happening or it's going to happen in 5 to 10 mm. years. Or oh, it'll happen once you watch the show. <laughs> Possibly. Because science fiction determines where science goes. Uh. But uh, do you follow uh, whatever is happening in the world of engineering technology? And how do you look at it affecting our country, our foreign policy, etc, cetera, etc? Cetera? You know, I'm not an engineer. And I'll give you what I hope is like a common sense answer from my perspective. And I'll take you back actually to your first question. Sure. You asked me, do I watch patterns? Okay. Sure, I watch patterns. That's how I do my business. That's why I think I can be good at my business. Now, just imagine I am humanly because I have limited capabilities as a human being. I'm watching the patterns of 200 people who I deal with every day. Imagine if I could process the patterns of 200 million people. 